Hi, I'm Todd, and this is going to be a quick tutorial on how to install PHP Storm 7 in Ubuntu, uh, or more appropriately, XUbuntu Desktop, which the same process either way. Uh, first off, I'll say that on the JetBrains website, the installation process is fairly simple. They say download it, extract it, and run it. Uh, but I prefer to uh, install it in a more Linux or Ubuntu appropriate manner in the correct directories and make it get it into the path. So the first thing we do is download PHP Storm 7 from the JetBrains.com site. I've already downloaded that. So once we're here, we're going to see, we're going to move the PHP Storm to the temp directory. We're going to extract it. Oh, I have to move to the temp directory first. I was wondering. It'll take just a second for that to happen. Go to sudo su. And we're going to move this new directory to opt and then we're going to go to opt and we're going to create first we're going to create a symbolic link from PHP storm to user bin PHP storm. We're going to exit out of sudo. We're going to go to our home directory. We're going to type PHP storm. And it loads up. Now for Ubuntu desktops, up another terminal. And we're going to go to CD user share applications. This is where your desktop launchers are located. I've already created, since this is an Ubuntu install, I've just installed XUbuntu desktop. create a launcher in Ubuntu, uh, Ubuntu you'll go to uh, your applications folder and then you'll sudo nano php storm desktop which I've already created it'll look just like this and once this is complete in your Ubuntu desktop you'll have an icon in your uh, launcher that you can place in your uh, quick bar or ever, wherever you want to do it if you're using Xubuntu like me, you go to your settings manager, your main menu, and you can create a new item with just uh, PHP Storm in the command. And you can choose the icon that's in that directory. That's all there is to it.